the upper peninsula of Michigan. Let's check out the forecast for around here tonight. Showers and thunderstorms, warm and muggy, low 70. And then for tomorrow, a morning shower should quit about 10 o'clock. I'm keeping my fingers crossed. Then partly sunny, and then late day storms, probably after 4 o'clock, the high 83. And for tomorrow night, a few lingering thunderstorms, not quite as muggy. We bottom out about 65 degrees. Then for your Memorial Day, mostly sunny. An isolated afternoon thunderstorm, the high 87, but that'll be the best day of the three because Tuesday, showers and thunderstorms 85, then Wednesday and Thursday, slightly cooler, the high about 80. So the $400,000 forecast, if I'm right, is that, do I get that much money? Or? Uh, no, I don't well, think so. No. He's already getting it, isn't he? <laughs> oh, that, absolutely. Then some, yeah, yeah. Right, we hope you're right. Like get this. that window in, that'd be great. That'll be great. Thanks, Ben. Mark Patrick next with your sports team. I'm Dick Ray. The drivers were running today at the Speedway. They were running from the rain. Next in sports, a grand send-off at the annual driver's meeting. Going to Ontario is like going on an adventure. The kids just love it there. The wide open spaces, breathtaking. Going to a foreign country, it's really cool. I never run out of things to do in Ontario. This summer, come up to Ontario, Canada. Call us at 1-800-ONTARIO for your free vacation planning kit. We're expecting you. It's very peaceful there. Smart fashions are at BJ's as special woman stores. And you'll want to race in for the smartest spring sale right now at BJ's and the special woman, where you'll save 25 to 50% on the most gorgeous spring things you ever saw. Spring blouses, dresses, separates, and coordinates are priced at 25 to 50% off. So you'll look terrific for all your springtime activities for less than you dream possible. Don't speed, but race as fast as you can for smart savings on spring things at all BJ's and a special woman's stores. My almost three-year-old son, Brett, was playing on top of the tractor. He climbed down onto the exhaust pipe and put his leg down. As soon as his leg touched, she stood up on it and started screaming. They came in the house, I went in and helped him put the water gel on. I could see the burn on his leg and it was really bad. Water gel seems to pull the pain out of the burn. It just pulls it right out. He just calmed down immediately. He's almost ready to get up and go play. It's something that you need to keep in your house. I wouldn't have a medicine chest without water gel in it. It's that important. At other burger places, before you even get there, they got a burger waiting on you. But it's Steak and Shake. I'll be waiting on you. These are our 100% recyclable containers. So, what exactly do you get when you order a platter? You decide. Steak and Shake. Famous for steak burgers. Parks here with sports. Uh, I guess a lot of fans around here are happy that the Bulls uh, have now done it. They look yeah, great. I'm one, I'm one of them. Well, you're a front runner, Tina. We've known that for a long time. Front runner. <laughs> I just want to see the Bulls win. You're on record. What? Well, well, no, I'm. I don't. Yes. Okay. They're the, they'll be the champions. There you have. Okay. They, well, no, they will probably be in the championship series, don't you think? <laughs> Is that Boy. safe to say now? Well, that's going, going out, out on, on the limb. limb. <laughs> Defending NBA champions find themselves in a hole no NBA team has ever overcome. So you're probably right, thanks, Tina. Thanks. They now face a three games to none deficit in the league's Eastern Conference Championship. Today in the Palace of Auburn Hills, a rather pursed lip Chuck Daly looked on. Look at that steal by Jordan. People forget the D he plays. Then he gets the assist to Paxson, who hits the J. But the Pistons didn't give up. Jerome... Look at that facial for Will Purdue from, from Sally. Isaiah hits an unbelievable shot here and gets the foul. But it's not going to be enough. Pippen to Grant, who scores and is fouled. 113-107, three games to zip the Bulls lead the series. Last night in L.A., the Lakers took a two games to none advantage in the Western Conference Finals as the much maligned Vladi Divac had a big game. didn't have that same approach until the latter part of the game, which was a little bit too late. And tonight, we wanted to come out and start it from the beginning and end up the same way. You know, Portland's a, a terrific team, very athletic. Uh, they do a lot of good things. And, uh, you know, like I said tonight, if you, if you, if you look around and watch, you know, they're the ones that are going to be doing it. You've got to be the ones doing it. Two games to one. I think I might have said two games to none, eh? Tomorrow, finally, almost here for race fans and for those who are just arriving and not lucky enough to hold a ticket to the parade, the public driver's meeting offers a glimpse of the men set to go the 500 miles tomorrow. 
Dick Ray reports on this historic gathering. In 34 appearances at this function, A.J. Foyt is used to this kind of reception. He's still not totally used to the idea this will be his final race at Indianapolis. Well, uh, I'm not really looking at it that way. You know, I'm planning on being here uh, many, many more years, and uh, I'm just going to this race like it's another race. And probably hit me next year when I come back up here. You know, being his last race, and to you know, sit on the front row with he and Mario, which are two of my heroes anyway, and uh, to be a part of A.J.'s last run, which... Uh, you know, he's he's a guy that's elevated this sport to what it is today, one of the main reasons it's where it's at. So, you know, to be a part of all of that together, it does make it special. There are other personalities adding to the build-up, and all share the pre-race excitement. Oh, it's very exciting. I mean, the motivation and the adrenaline, is, you know, it's, it's tremendous. It's a great feeling. But once you fire the engine up, on go the blinders. It's showtime. With three weeks of preparation behind them, the distinguished field of 33 all feel they're prepared to deal with any kind of scenario that might creep up on the big day. But there are some things in racing that you just can't control. You can't hardly discuss race strategy without weather coming up. I think that we can move up pretty quickly and then, uh, then just depending on the weather, uh, see what we have to do. And if it be warm and hot, we, we hope we know what to do to the car. Because I ran last week when it was really hot on full tanks. And if the weather cools down, we know as well what to do to the car. It's full weather. I think that's, that will be the key on the race to keep the car performing consistent the whole 500 miles. I have a positive feeling uh, most of the time when I know the car is running well. I think uh, realistically, uh, I think uh, I have every reason to feel that way. So, again, going in, you know, I think things look good. And I hope the man upstairs uh, gives us a hand. Back to AJ, he's left the door cracked open ever so slightly. I would say, you know, you, you never want to say everything is for sure. You know, I'd say probably 95%. And, you know, after we get back here next year, and uh, I've had a few laps here, and where we got in the cockpit, you just never know what you might do at a spray of a moment. One thing is certain, AJ Foyt will be ready for the green flag at 11 o'clock in the morning. At the Speedway, Dick Ray, Wish TV, Sports 8. In the big leagues today, the fans are seeing red in Cincinnati after the Dodgers have blown out the home team in the first two games of that much ballyhooed series. At Riverfront and on Wish TV this afternoon, Tommy Lasorda talking over recipes with Lou Pinella. Eddie Murray single. Eddie with three RBI on the day. It gave the Dodgers a one-zip lead, scoring Juan Samuel. Kevin Gross who then hits a ball over his head for a single. He was hitting 100 before that base hit. Singles home, Griffin, for a four-zip L.A. lead. This Eddie Murray single brings home Gross and Butler. Six-zip L.A. The Dodgers have now won three straight with the victory today. In the America... Oh, look at this. The pace lap in Shea Stadium today. The Mets and the Cardinals. Howard Johnson. Hello. A big-time home run. Hojo has been hot in the last three weeks. Then Felix Jose doubles home Langford and Gilkey. And the Cardinals go on to a 7-2 victory this afternoon. In the American League, the Brewers were hosting the Indians in Brewtown. Carlos Bayerga hits a three-run home run. It was fair, giving the Indians a three-zip lead. But Greg Vaughn doubles home. Taking a 4-3 lead of the eighth, but the Indians come back and win it with Luis Lopez scoring the winning run on Felix Fetterman's RBI single. All right, Mark, thanks very much. You thanks bet. Mark. We'll be back with a few final notes in just a moment. Fredder challenges H.H. Gregg. Greg's price on this Whirlpool gas range was $599.99, a good price, but over $40 higher than Fretter's everyday price. And on this Amana 25 cubic foot refrigerator, Greg's price was more than $100 higher than Fretter, proving once again, it's always better to shop at Fretter. When you shop at Mr. D, you're the one we're determined to please. We determine every day to please you in every way. 
Anchorage Bologna, two for three dollars. Oscar Mayer Franks, 99 cents. And Wilson Continental Deli Light Meats, three sixty-nine a pound. At Mr. D. Determined to please. Your Central Indiana Buick dealers are offering the deal of the century. Yes, for a limited time only, due to special factory and dealer arranged discounts, your monthly cost on a brand new 91 Buick Century is only $249. That's right, only $249 per month includes these features. Air conditioning, cruise control, tilt steering, clock, AM, FM stereo, steel welded radials, and more. Don't wait, because the offer is so good, it's limited. See your Central Indiana Buick dealers for their $249 per month deal of the century today. We'll have that story about the firefighters tonight at 11 o'clock. Sorry, but we've run out of time for now. I'm Neil Moore. And I'm Tina Cosby. We will be back at 11 with that story and more. Join us then. Good night. Good night.